all trying to be really loud. Shouldn't be a problem. What? No joke? I thought for sure I had something on that one. Brothers and sisters in Christ, through the sacrament of baptism, we are initiated into Christ's holy church. We are incorporated into God's mighty act of salvation, and through the mystery of faith, given new birth through water and the Spirit. All of this is God's grace gift, offered to us without price. This morning, coming forth for Christian baptism is Rachel, Hunter, Kaylee, and Mason. I will be asking each of them questions regarding their faith journey, but also we have Rebecca Black to be presenting her son, Braden, uh, for baptism. And I will be asking her the same questions, though she is not responding for Braden, she's responding as a covenant she is making to present Braden in this holy sacrament. These historic questions are an invitation, they are a promise, a sacred moment, that they will do everything in their power to uphold and live in the community and the kingdom that they are a part of. So on behalf of the whole church, I ask you, do you renounce the spiritual forces of wickedness, reject the evil powers of this world, and repent of your sins if you do say, I do? I do. Do you accept the freedom and power God gives you to resist evil, injustice, and oppression in whatever forms they present themselves if you do say, I do? I do. And do you confess Jesus Christ as your Savior, put your whole trust in His grace, and promise to serve Him as your Lord in union with the church which Christ has opened up to people of all ages, nations, and races, if you do say, I do. I do. Rachel, Hunter, Kaylee, and Mason, according to the grace given to you, will you remain faithful disciples of Christ and of His church and serve as His representatives in the world? If you will say, I will. I will. And Rachel? Will you nurture, nurture Braden in Christ's holy church that by your teaching and example, but Rebecca, <laughs> oh, why did I even type it wrong? <laughs> uh, Rebecca, will you nurture Braden? Well, Rachel, you've heard this too. In Christ's holy church that by your teaching and example, he may be guided to accept God's grace for himself, to profess his faith openly, and lead a Christian life. You will say, I will. Okay. Rachel's going to come forward and she's going to be sprinkled. The rest of the kids are going to be dunked. So I'm going to invite her to come on up here. And you'll look around. Let's see if I can work this over here. Rachel, the Holy Spirit, work within you that being born through water and the Spirit, you may continue to become a faithful disciple of Jesus Christ. Amen. Did you pray with me? Lord, we thank you for Rachel. We thank you for her gift of life and for the life that she brings to this family. We pray that uh, you would indeed work within her, that uh, she would continue to know you more and more each day, and that her light would shine brilliantly and brightly. For all that you do in her, for the kingdom's sake, we pray this in the name of Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. And all God's people say, Amen. 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 As a baptized Christian, Mama's going to come over here and help me with these kids. So let's get Hunter.
water and the Holy Spirit work within you to be born through water and the Spirit, you may continue to become a faithful disciple of Jesus Christ. Amen. Now don't get the floor wet, all right? <laughs> Baptism is a community covenant which we have a sacred test, trust to each individual that comes for baptism. Do you as a community of faith, and do you reaffirm both the rejection of, your, of sin and your commitment to Christ? Will you accept the responsibility of coming alongside these baptized sisters and brothers, encouraging them in the journey of faith? How will you respond? We will. Yeah. Members of the household of faith, I commend to your love and care, Rachel Hunter, Kaylee, Mason, and Braden, whom we this day recognize as members of this covenant family of God. Will you endeavor to sow, to live their life, to live your life, so that they may grow in the knowledge of God through our Savior, Jesus Christ. Amen. We will so order our lives after the example of Christ, that Rachel, Hunter, Kaylee, Mason, Braden, Surrounded by steadfast love, we may continue in the journey of faith and the way that leads to life eternal. Pray for the Lord. Amen. Thanks be to God. Thanks be to God. As we celebrate the, their baptism, we also celebrate the other sacrament that we share as the body of Christ, and that is the breaking of the bread and the lifting up of the cup. This holy meal that invites us to know that Jesus has given us everything, literally turn the world upside down so that we might be part of this covenant family. <laughs> 